Just off Interstate 40 near the California-Arizona border, there is a mysterious Earth figure that has a baffling origin story. And it even gets more mysterious when you look at it from the sky. John Bartell here, making a little pit stop at the Topak Maze. No one truly knows how the rows and rows of rock piles ended up at the edge of the Colorado River in the Havasu Wilderness, but one theory claims that the Topak Mystic Maze was a part of a gravel collection for early railroad construction. But if you ask the Fort Mojave tribe, they'll tell you the maze was used by indigenous people long before the railroads were even invented. We believe that when we're cremated, we go to that area and have a Sioux landing to the Neal's Peaks. Simon Garcia is one of the chosen cremators for the Mojave tribe. It's his job to prepare the dead for the afterlife. And th this is my thought. As a cremator, now I say that that we follow through that area before we go, right? Simon can't explain everything, but he believes the Topak Mystic Maze isn't a burial ground, but rather a spiritual portal or door to the next life. We don't know who built it, but they built it and we came in. The evenly spaced rows of rock piles just outside the town of Topak, Arizona are not actually in the shape of a maze, but that's how photographer Edward Curtis described the rows of rocks in his pictorial book that he produced in 1908. And the name, Topak Mystic Maze, just stuck. We call Noyhavi Gamachavi, the gathering place. Today, the Bureau of Land Management protects the maze because much of it has been lost. It's believed that the Mystic Maze once encompassed over 50 acres of land, but the construction of railroads, freeways, and gas pipelines reduced it to about 10 acres. Exactly. I'm not trying to say I know what it is, but I'm trying to bring some light to what it might be. Much mystery surrounds the Mystic Maze, but one thing is for sure. This is a sacred place for the Fort Mojave tribe, and it should be respected by those who visit. From the Topak Maze, I'm John Bartell. Hope to see you on the back roads.